Today I've got a really interesting prepping related item here and it's the Pro Med Kit from Duration Health and this company helped me get a variety of potentially life-saving prescription medications including antibiotics and steroids that I can keep on hand in case of an emergency. At the moment, global tensions seem to be peaking and supply chain issues only seem to be getting worse and worse and all the uncertainty ahead is fueling me to personally take some steps to be more prepared for whatever type of fallout might ensue as a result and this kit fit really nicely into my plan for becoming more self-reliant in an emergency situation. I wanted to give a shout out to City Prepping on YouTube and that was a channel that originally exposed me to Duration Health and he produces a lot of great prepping content as well as a really logic-based and sensible look at world events and how they might affect the prepping community. So if you're not familiar with him, go ahead and check out that channel. There's a link down in the description below. Anyways, Duration Health are used to working with people who might want to be prepared for disasters and other grid down situations as well as people who might be traveling to remote locations or going on adventures so you don't have to worry about explaining to them why you might want this kit because they definitely seem to understand the prepper mindset and they also provide you with non-urgent support via email so if you do need help or have questions about using the medications in your kit you have another resource you can reach out to that might be able to assist you if you're facing a local emergency and this is a great way to get your prescription medications now before you need them in an emergency the pro med kit comes in a nice high-vis orange zippered case which is a great way to keep the items in your kit organized and it's easy to pack up and go with at a moment's notice. The top zippered compartment is where the medications that come in the kit are kept and they are secured in place with some elastic bands and if you order any additional medications they will also most likely be here but there's plenty of additional room in the section for adding some more medications. There's also a large zippered bottom compartment which gives you some additional storage so you can add more items to the kit and it also comes with a field guide which is basically a guide you can use to treat yourself as a last resort. If you're unable to contact your doctor or reach your local emergency room. There is information in here about the medications in the kit and other common over-the-counter medications as well, as well as the most common medical complaints that you're likely to face and the course of action that you should take depending on your symptoms. All right, so let's dive in and take a quick look at the prescription medications that came in my kit. First up, we have prednisone, which is an oral steroid, which can be used to treat inflammation, breathing problems, and severe allergic reactions. There's doxycycline, which is an antibiotic that can be used to treat multiple types of infections, including respiratory tract infections, tick-borne illness, E. coli, cholera, Lyme disease, and more. Azithromycin is another antibiotic that can be used to treat respiratory infections like pneumonia, abdominal infections, ear infections, and throat infections. Triamcinolone is a topical steroid that can be used to treat swelling, itching, and redness of the skin. Ofloxacin is an antibiotic drop that can be used to treat eye infections like bacterial conjunctivitis, which is pink eye and ear infections like otitis externa, which is swimmer's ear. Finally, there's ceflaxin, which is an antibiotic used to treat skin infections, urinary tract infections, respiratory infections, ear infections, and more. Now, these are just the basic items in the kit, but there are a handful of different prescription medications that you can have added on, including ones that might be useful for traveling or ones that are specific to women's health, as well as different tools like test strips and thermometers. I had some clotrimazole cream added, which is a general purpose antifungal cream. I also wanted to show you guys a few different things that I added to this kit and the way it's set up now it can easily be tossed into a vehicle suitcase or bug out bag and I should have many of my basics covered this is just a basic medical kit it's not a trauma kit so keep that in mind and there's also a ton of different great ideas in the field guide for things that you can add to this kit and these are just some of the items that me and my family find ourselves using most often first up I've got some triple antibiotic ointment for basic wound care another tube of clotrimazole cream some liquid bandage which is basically a bandage that you paint over your skin and these are some liquid IVs which are a hydration multiplier and they're good for preventing dehydration and there's also some immunity boosting supplements in here as well. I've got a big bottle of acetaminophen which is a pain reliever and a fever reducer and this is probably an item that I will downsize to make room for additional items in the future. I've got some Pepto for kids and some Pepto for adults and these help with upset stomach relief and they're also an anti-diarrheal. These are urine test strips and can detect if you have a UTI. This is Calicler lotion which is really soothing if you have bug bites or burns or some other kind of skin irritation. I've also got some children's acetaminophen and some Flonase which is good for relieving seasonal allergies. There's some children Motrin which is another pain reliever and fever reducer for my kids 
And finally, some generic children's Benadryl, which is also useful for allergies and mild allergic reactions. Anyways, this kit is definitely a work in progress, and I'm going to be downsizing a few items and adding a few more to the kit. But if there's any other items that you think should be added to this kit, please go ahead and share those in the comments down below. If you're interested in getting this kit for yourself, there's a custom link set up down below for people who follow my channel, and you'll save $50 on this kit. And if you do purchase it through my link, I will also receive a small commission, which will help me grow the channel further. Thanks so much for watching and if you enjoyed the video please give it a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this one